So for those of you from the English media, we will start with tonight's game and then we'll move on to Sunday's game against West Ham, which will be embargoed. So if you want to start with tonight. It was a tough match, tough match, like we expected, always away from home in the Europe Conference League. It's tough. Um, I think we, we compete well. We compete well in terms of attack. I think we should should finish the actions better. Some combinations that were missing. And um, there was a period in the second half that we lost a little bit of control. Um, but in terms of lack of focus in the in the moment of the goal, details that, that we should improve like we always do. Uh, Conference League is always a chance to, <coughs> to have minutes on the players. Um, players that work hard and deserve so this is what it was all about so let's let's progress in terms of the group I think we have two games at home uh, <coughs> against VTS against Ren and then we have to play Mura that we can uh, we can solve the situation of the group do you think some of those players took their chance to show you what they could do tonight that is not 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 uh, the question is having minutes <coughs> compete uh, improve uh, because like you know it's a we have a tough, tough schedule ahead of us. We, we're going to need all the players in the best conditions possible. Do you think that's not having someone stronger on the bench that at least turn to if you need? Mm. Then you're going to discuss the options and decisions, but the decision was made. Uh, we, we, <coughs> we took a uh, moment to decide, and we decided uh, to bring um, the players that start and uh, with the under 10 to give to give us support. Uh, we use only uh, Dylan because you consider that the game only required require that. You, know, you still have nine internationals, I think, yeah. in the starting eleven. So, I mean, do you think, as difficult as it is to, to make eleven changes, do you think you, you can expect more from from those guys than they showed tonight? No, I knew that the game is going to be going to be tough. I'm not I'm not here to judge the players. I'm here to to try and, and improve them. Uh, the analysis and the judgment we do it behind closed doors like you can understand you know you spoke yesterday about um, Steven Bergvine coming back into the team obviously his yeah. first game coming back here what, what did you make of his, his performance tonight mm, he needs he needs to to to, to get back 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 in levels of fitness um, he was more involved in the first half the second half naturally he dropped a little bit but this is what we need to the place to be in the pitch to to get, like I said before, the best fitness levels that can possibly do. You know, uh, Glenn Hoddle has just said on TV, Tottenham's attitude was wrong and they need to look at themselves in the mirror. Would you agree with that assessment? I'm not gonna, please, I'm not gonna comment on on any words from, with all my respect for Glenn Hoddle, I will not comment these words, my analysis made uh, between us and what I have to say, I'll say to the players. Is it difficult you know, for this bunch of players to be motivated when they perhaps feel they are the second string players who play in, in this competition as opposed to the ones who play in the league? No, I don't consider this way. I don't consider this way. I think that uh, a football match is always a chance to compete. So our approach is always the same. So we expect all the players to compete in all the matches, no matter what competition we are involved. Do you think Dane is, is ready to play at this level, Nuno? If it looked like it was quite difficult. Dane is uh, he's 17 years old. Dane is 17 years old. He is tough, tough for him. Uh, but many of, of our players when we were 17, they were not involved in, in first team football. So. It's full of talent, of course, details that comes with experience and the experience is when he competes against uh, top professionals like he did against against Vitesse today. Would, would you prefer to have a more experienced backup striker for Harry in the squad? Is that something you'll look at? Mm, no, the squad is, is what we have and it's my job, our job to, to take care of all of them. I'm not going to comment on all. Okay, should we move on to Aston?